Hello, it is Summer Olmstead here, and we are going to start our Scrabble game. And let's just jump right into it with part one. Um, let's see. All right, now I'm gonna take off my screen. So what we're doing right here is we are doing problem one which is we are going to be getting the word score for each time a word is inputted into to calculate like what the score is so here's all of our kind of conditions we got going here for it and here's like the math to find it so yeah so what we're first going to do is word score equals zero. We're going to first initialize the variable and then we're going to have a for loop for i in word. So each letter in the word, um, if i in scrabble underscore letter values. Oh, I could have just, oops. Um, we're gonna do a little I in here, and then of course, what we got, then we're gonna do word score is plus or equal to Scrabble letter. Wait a minute, wait a minute, I don't wrote this to pass this one. It should just be this. And then this one should be values with the I. Okay, okay. So what this is doing right here is we're going to look for each letter in the word we're going to see if it's in the scrap world letter values, which that is, I believe, a dictionary up here. Yes. And this is what identifies all the points to each letter. So then our word score is going to be accumulated of all of each points for each letter in the word. And that's where we're first going to start off with because this is the first task because this is going to be the sum of points for letters in the word. And now we're going to multiply by the length of the word. So what we're going to do is word score times equals, well, actually, whenever I tried that earlier, it did not work out for some reason. Um, so we're just going to do it this way. <laughs> and then the length of the word. All right. So... Now what we're going to do is the if the length of the word equals n, our word score is going to add 50 points to it. And lastly, we're going to return word score. So yeah, this is pretty much all the math involved for it. We are going to have basically just to summarize word score we're first initializing it because don't throw an error if you don't initialize it before you start referencing it so it's initially zero but then once the person enters a word we're going to look through all the letters in the word and we're going to have each of the sum of those letters to add to the word score then we're going to have our word score to be times the length of word is going to be what the new word score is. And then in, on the condition that if the length of the word score is equal to n, which is the hand size, it could be seven, it could be anything, honestly, then we're going to be adding 50 points to your score. And then we're going to be returning the overall word score after that. All right. So we run, the, don't mind this. <laughs> um, okay. <laughs> now we're going to test our get word score. And now we're going to test this. And wow, it was successful, which is great. 
So that was my problem one out of seven. See you in the next video.